Aging is a natural process. But why do some people live to be 90 years old, while others do not live to be 70? Genetics alone cannot explain this difference. But in recent years, science is getting closer to explaining the mechanisms of longevity. Japanese scientist Yoshinori Osumi won the Nobel Prize for research on autophagy. What is this, and what does it have to do with longevity? How to apply the Japanese scientists' findings in practice? We will tell you about this in our video, and at the end we will give a specific program for improving health and prolonging life, taking into account the process of autophagy. What is autophagy? Translated from the Greek, the word means self-eating. In modern science, the term autophagy is used to describe the process of self-destruction of defective cells and using the resources released to build new ones. Dr. Osumi was not the first to discover this process. But in the course of his research he proved that autophagy is activated during nutrient deficiencies. It is in a situation of starvation that cells start looking for resources in themselves and most effectively clean the body of spent cells and the toxins they secrete. Dr. Osumi conducted his experiments on yeast, but later he noticed that the same processes are present in the human body as well. Only in the case of our body, autophagy is stimulated by a lack of protein of animal origin. But starvation itself also gives an even greater impetus to the body's purification. Mechanism of Autophagy Within autophagy, it all starts with starvation. Lack of nutrients increases blood levels of the hormone glucagon and decreases insulin levels. Growth hormone production also increases, resulting in a large number of young cells. These require amino acids, which are released when the body eats the old cells. Cell renewal itself is very important because it reduces the risk of cancer and Alzheimer's disease. That's why the health benefits of fasting are increasingly being proven. Moreover, it activates the SIRT1 gene, which is responsible for longevity. Thus, autophagy solves several problems at once it reduces the risk of autoimmune diseases, as well as rejuvenates and cleanses the body. How to use the process of autophagy? Based on Dr. Osumi's developments, a system of therapeutic fasting has been created. It includes several variants, so that everyone can choose the system according to his or her health and daily regimen. The central concept of such a system is the food window. This is the period during which it is possible to take food. The first is a 16 by 8 system that allows 3 meals a day for 8 hours and 16 hours of abstinence from food. The second option is 14 times 10. The essence is the same, but at the expense of a larger food window, such fasting is more easily tolerated. The third scheme is 20 for 4. In such a small food window you have to eat twice a meal. In the diet must necessarily be high calorie products. In addition to these schemes, there are three variants of complete fasting. Within a day, for 36 hours, from 8 in the morning until 8 in the evening the next day, and for two days. In the latter case, a small intake of food once a day, up to 500 calories, is allowed. It is important to take into account that in the process of fasting it is necessary to drink water, not less than one and a half liters, and at first milk and tea without sugar are allowed. It is necessary to come out of the fast smoothly, begin to eat little by little. It is also important to monitor how you feel and avoid nausea, dizziness, or weakness from hunger. The option of dry fasting is allowed, but it can be used not more than one day a week. Therefore, it is better still to fast with plenty of drinking for one day followed by two days of normal meals or two days followed by seven days of meals. The usefulness of such techniques for prolonging life has already been proven and more and more people around the world are using them for their own health improvement. Do you practice fasting? Tell us about your results in the comments.